as we now move on to the fourth fight of the night. Ivan Ortiz of Mexico City will be taking on Elvis Rodriguez, who's making his pro debut. And there we see the man, Ivan Ortiz. You're ready to do battle here, the big punch arena. Has a record of one and seven, but from what we've seen with these other fighters, with the not the most pleasing records, they've given a good account of themselves. Tough dudes. As we see Elvis Rodriguez made his pro debut all the way from Santo Domingo in the Dominican Republic. A lot of amateur experience. Elvis has. As we take it up now to uh, Pablo Flores to get the particulars for this matchup. Damas y caballeros, Puriseca Boxing Promotions y VIB, the best in boxing. Presentan este encuentro pactado cuatro rounds en la división de peso super ligero. Let's get ready for four rounds of boxing in the lightweight division. Entries to your first the fighter standing in the bull corner, wearing black trunks with white trim. He officially weighs in at 140 pounds. Presentando ustedes en la esquina azul, vistiendo pantaloncillo color negro con blanco, con un peso de 140 libras. He stands with eight professional bouts. Cuenta con ocho combates profesionales de la ciudad de México. Iván Ortiz. And his opponent across the ring is standing in the red corner wearing blue trunks, white and red. He officially weighs in at 140 pounds. Y su rival en la esquina roja, vistiendo pantaloncillo color azul con blanco y rojo, con un peso idéntico de 140 libras. And tonight, he makes his pro debut, haciendo su debut profesional en esta noche. Elvis, the Dominican, Rodríguez. And here is where the final instructions, dando las indicaciones finales, su referee, Juan Morales Lee. Cuatro rounds. Mucho cuidado con la cabeza, no rabbit boys. No riñones, no abajo del cinturón, no golpes con el hombro ni con de revés. Dense la mano que gane mejor. Suerte para los dos. All right, folks, the fourth fight of the night about to get underway. Marcus Viegas here on the call with my broadcast partner, Brandon Cruz. Seeing Elvis Rodriguez in the blue shorts with red trim, making his pro debut all the way from Santo Domingo, Dominican Republic, taking on Ivan Ortiz from Mexico City. Elvis Kid Rodriguez has a plethora of amateur experience. Seeing in his corner, Pepper Riley, former Olympian as well. In the southpaw stance as he just landed a straight right there, straight left, excuse me, a few moments ago. Another big kid here in the super lightweight division, 140 pounds. Ivan Rodriguez, eight fights as a pro. It's a very awkward style as well. He's a bit herky-jerky. Awkward style. As you would expect. Elvis, Elvis seeming to ha handle it pretty well. Yeah, you would. Well, I would think he would have uh, felt him out, but no, he's just he's letting his hands go. Once you start landing with that jab, that gives you full-fledged confirmation to take flight. Kid is fast. Elvis staying behind that jab. Hardly. Right hook. Two straight punch, punches landed flush from Elvis Rodriguez. 
follows it up with a body shot there, lands clean. Picking his shots. He's picking Elvis, uh, excuse me, not Elvis, uh, picking Ivan apart so far. Digs in the body well, gets great leverage on the shots. Great shots from Elvis. You can see the composure for it being your pro debut. Great composure on him. Yeah, he seems relaxed in there. Like he knows he has this fight in the bag. Total control so far. Sit in the bag. Knows when those shots come back. Knows when to keep those hands up. Shots by Elvis. Ten seconds left in this round number one. Rodriguez in control so far. Not fighting like a pro debut fighter. Looks very calm and collected in there. Technically looks fantastic as well. First round of his pro career in the books. So far, Brandon, I like what I see as we take a look now at the replays here. Beautiful jab, knows when to set that up. Full body mechanics going through. Beautiful shots, I love the way he put, brings that hand right back up. He misses the body shot and he brings that hand right back up just in case something comes back. Boristeca Boxing Promotions, fundada en el mes de agosto del año 2014, lleva más de 20, 20 eventos. Comenzó en la ciudad de Ensenada, Baja California, y hoy es la mejor empresa de las dos Californias. Round number two here. Elvis Rodriguez uh, looking like a pro in that first round. See what's in store in this round number two. Tall, lanky southpaw. Those are always the hardest opponents to fight, huh, Brian? Oh, yeah. What makes it so difficult? Um, very good footwork, especially I mean, where he's from. Santo Domingo, I mean, you, you know, from the Dominican Republic, you know they have great footwork, great angles. Beautiful leverage shots from Rodriguez. Yeah, Rodriguez just letting go on these punches. He's getting his full weight in there. Ivan, stone faced though, not showing any effects of the punches on him, or at least giving his best poker face in there. Ivan's gonna have to start coming back with some shots. Yeah, he got clocked there with the hook. Did Ivan Ortiz. Good work there to the body. Fouls Beautiful the right top. hook by Rodriguez. Ortiz able to handle the power of Rodriguez so far. This is a four round fight. Elvis Rodriguez not showing any jitters, any nervousness. He looks smooth in there, collected, not throwing anything overly crazy. Everything's technically sound. Great body shots, great composure. Knows when to come in, knows when to leave out. Beautiful. So he has Ortiz on his back foot here. Not giving him much space to work with. Straight right hand there, right on the money. Beautiful right hook. The only thing that I do see that, ooh, ooh uppercut there. Beautiful left uppercut. Follows it up again. Let's go, 
The only thing I would say shots. is Elvis Rodriguez does leave that right hand a little bit low. He could get countered by Ivan Rodriguez. I mean, Ivan Ortiz needs to be a bit careful, but I think he's just so technically he's better. He's so well. His reflexes are on yeah. point. He knows when to bring that hand right back up after the shots he's taking. He knows when to bring it back up, just like how you see. So far, after two rounds, it's been a pleasure to watch Elvis Rodriguez there. Just textbook stuff from him and the combinations that he's been throwing. As we look at some of these combinations that Rodriguez landed in that Beautiful round number right two. Hook he lands back with that jab, sets it up. And we could be seeing the beginning of something great in Rodriguez. Ortiz taking deep breaths there in the corner. It's a tough way to make a living. Round three here. Elvis Rodriguez. Just having his way here with Ivan Ortiz. Ortiz not being able to muster any sort of offense really that's effective. He's just been overwhelmed by Rodriguez. The harder puncher, the faster puncher, the more technical fighter. Ortiz lands those shots, but Rodriguez comes right back with even harder shots. Rodriguez has been the aggressor through two rounds. Landing these punches with ease, just having his way in there. Two-piece combination there. Follows it up with a straight right hand. Ortiz swinging wildly, missing. Another straight there, stuns Ortiz, Ortiz. That was coming back. Yeah, Beautiful leverage shots as he comes back. Beautiful body mechanics. Rodriguez, Rodriguez take him out. could be close to getting a stoppage here against Ortiz. He's really digging into these shots. Ortiz. In deep trouble here. Blood pouring out of his nose. Everything that Rodriguez is throwing is landing flush on him. Corner might want to get in this and call a wave to the fight. It's taking a lot of damage here. Referee taking a close look now. Unanswered punches, and that's it. Oh, it's over. Smart stoppage there by the referee. Elvis Rodriguez, what a beast, wow. This kid got a, a ton of talent as he gets a stoppage win over Ivan Ortiz. Great angles, great shots. Fundamentally sound. Fans, keep your eye on this kid right here, Elvis Rodriguez. Has a bright future. So we take a look at the stoppage now. Brandon, take us through it. Comes in with that, that left hand to the body, tries to set it up. Back again, full leverage shots. I love the way he turns that body. You can see that whole body mechanic. Ortiz not coming back with anything. Ref starts coming in, stops it. Yeah, smart stoppage. And I, you know what, honestly, I, I even think the corner maybe should have stopped it 10, 15 seconds before oh, yeah. that. All smiles in the corner of Elvis Rodriguez. 
I have a feeling there's going to be much more smiles. Great win and proving on to 1-0. Yeah. Kid is good. Looks like he's the real deal. You know, and this is what the series over here on Fight Up TV on the best in boxing is all about, finding these diamonds in the rough and bringing them to you folks at home so you could witness the start of their journey from their pro careers from the beginning all the way up until they become contenders. And this series has done this time and time again, bringing talent like Elvis Rodriguez Damas y caballeros, este combate llega a su fin con un tiempo de 2 minutos 14 segundos en el tercer asalto. We have the official time of 2 minutes and 14 seconds in round number 3. The clear winner by the way of TKO victory. Su ganador por la vía del knockout técnico. The Dominican Santo Domingo para Elvis Rodríguez. Large crowd Elvis brought with them. There we see Elvis Rodriguez motioning to the camera. All smiles. Gets the first professional win of his career. I got a, I got a sneaky feeling, Brandon, that he's going to go far. Oh, yeah. Fundamentally sound. Has a great corner behind him. Keep your eye on him, guys. He's gonna make something of himself in boxing. <laughs>